You're watching Throttle House. I'm Thomas. And I'm James. And this is a drag race. <laughs> this is simple. The two newest EV trucks going head to head. The tri-motor monster from Detroit and the new quad-motor upstart from California. If you've seen our Hummer review, you'll know it's a rocket off the line, just like the Rivian. But we filmed this race at the beginning of the same day, before the rest of our testing, to make sure that both of these trucks were at the highest state of charge possible. Let's do this. All right, in the Rivian. Yeah, the Hummer's got more power, but I'm 2,000 pounds lighter, so I'm feeling confident. This has a limiter, actually, at 110 miles an hour, where it stops accelerating, kind of. So that's going to be interesting, because I think the Hummer might have one as well, which means this is anybody's race. And what's so refreshing is that we're comparing two electric vehicles, and Tesla hasn't managed to get in the way of that. Oh, really? 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 Yeah, we brought the Model X pad along, bit cheeky, but... It's so quick, that car, and there's no such thing as a Cybertruck, that it provides context for how stupidly quick these trucks are. So it's exciting, actually. Uh, we've also brought it along because we're giving one away with Omaze. So for your chance to win a Model X Plaid, brand new, go to this link. We'll talk about it more at the end, but the other upside is that your entry goes towards helping a great cause. All right, let's do this. Yeah, it's gonna win. Anyway, the real race is between that Rivian and this Hummer EV, which I'm so stoked to drive because this is the biggest, dumbest, most ridiculous EV I've ever seen in my life. And the only reason we have it today is because of the legends at Tustin Buick GMC who were so kind to drive this thing all the way out here for us. We're very, very happy that they were able to bring this out for us. Now, the most important thing and the only thing that you actually need to know is that when I double tap this, and then I select OK. It puts it in Watts to Freedom mode, which I believe is an abbreviation for WTF, which stands for, I'm not sure what that is. It's like, who's there, fish? Or what's the Frank? Anyway, I haven't launched this yet, so we're going to see what happens. All I can tell you right now, and I hope this is part of the experience, my butt is being vibrated. So, yeah. Drive. Woo, listen to the sound. <laughs> okay, so he's he's doing his cheetah mode in the Model X Plaid, and he's doing his what's to freedom mode in the, um, they're all dropping. I haven't got any fancy tricks in this. I've got it in sport. I've got brake regen high, stability's reduced, and ride height is at the lowest, as recommended by our Rivian rep for this exact moment. It's just a, just a true honest car. I'm just gonna brake torque and just slam my foot and to see what happens. Anybody's game. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, that flat is gone. My legs is off. Oh, come on. Coming after you, Rivian. I'm in front of the Hummer. Go on, Rivian. You lightweight, beautiful bastard. Come on. Okay, so I haven't told you this yet, but I have 106 mile an hour top speed, and there it is. No! I've maxed out at 115, actually. 115, not 110. Okay, that was the most exciting launch I've done in an EV. There's just noises and graphics, and the suspension, even though it lowers itself, is the goopiest, soupiest thing I've ever seen. And I'm on truck tires, so I can just hear it. I have a limiter. Do you? Yeah. Where? 106 miles an hour. 106? Yes. So I apparently I have 110, but I hit 115. Rivian's cheating, that's all I know. That's all I know. Momentum, mate. So you have a limiter at 106, and you weigh 9,500 pounds. I didn't have a chance. You know, that Model X is quite quick, isn't it? Yeah, you don't say. Uh, yeah, thanks, Joey, for bringing that out. <laughs> uh, all right, well, you know what? Let's leave him out of the next one. Okay. And let's do a roll. Let's do a roll because race? Because I, I, slightly cheekily, I'm on street tires. Yeah. So I do have a traction advantage. Yeah. So let, what happens when we remove that? 
First okay. 106 wins. <laughs> okay. <laughs> rolling race. Rolling race. All right, we're going to do a 30 roll, and maybe we won't even be at that near that top speed, so we might actually have a chance at seeing which one of these is quicker in a street race. Oh, that Rivian. This has just got too much mass to move. Oh, it's so much quicker. The weight advantage is immediately obvious. Although that Hummer bucks. Come on, go! Yeah. And I'm at my limiter, and that means that he's at his, which is lower. I feel like he's got a curfew. Like we're out partying and he has a curfew before me. I still hit the top speed. Ugh. Can I just say, I know it's a matter of public safety, but those limiters feel very low. They do feel very low, 106? you 106? Know? Yeah, like after the, 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 the plaid is able yeah. to hit Mach 3 within a school zone, like, you'd think that these they give these things... I think we can agree that these are quite impressive trucks, though. Seriously impressive. Like, they're so quick, right? But I could feel it when we went down on the roll race. I could feel... The weight. I could feel the weight in I this one. I watched it. Yeah. I watched the Hummer go... Oh, no. <laughs> so fun, though. Really, oh, like, God. surprisingly fun. Surprisingly Who fun said to race can't be fun? Hold on a second. I just got, I got to turn off my watch to freedom mode because it's buzzing my butt. It's real weird. That car's all about freedom. Ah, uh, that's it means WTF, right? Yeah, so, I wasn't sure what that stood for, so I, I just ripped a few. Yeah, plaid. Next car they'll do is Holy Schmidt. <laughs> At some point, I want one of them to come along and just say, "Yeah, this is f***ing fast mode." <laughs> <laughs> just be honest about it. Yeah, it's exactly Stop what it is. Stop skirting it. This is a seriously cool truck. It is a shooting star, boulder, dangerous, awesome thing. I just, I kind of love it. It is totally a modern. Hummer. Yep. It has the looks, it has the size, and it has the amazing graphics on the inside, which, by the way, were actually designed by Perception on Epic Games' Unreal Engine. Its ability to achieve shattering speed despite its weight is shocking. The Hummer EV is a clear example of GM just having fun. And yes, the Rivian R1T can best it in acceleration from a dig and even more effectively on a roll, and it doesn't have a squeaky roof. But either way, both of these trucks prove that, you know what, EVs can sometimes be a pretty good time. But if blinding acceleration is your thing, as we mentioned, thanks to Omaze, you can enter to win a Model X Plaid by going to omaze.com slash throttlehouse to enter. Not only do your entries give you a chance to win, but they also go toward helping two great causes. In this case, it's Give Power and 501c3, both of whom are focused on increasing the availability and stability of drinking water, food security, and shelter. So go there, enter, and good luck. Thanks for watching.